Dug out by Witt. Set will come down the middle. Murray gets a hand on it, but out of play. And the thing to watch there is Creighton, they just get to the ball. Snowboard still at the line. Far side for Zimmerman again, dug out. Seton Hall playing terrific right now. They'll come near side this time, and they get it. Creighton finally flips the floor, and it's Erica. Something might be brewing inside the Wall Street Museum right now. Madeline Cole stuffs it over. That's for Doles all, Spellbar. Sets it up for Gasser. Kept alive, hits the banners. Blue Jays get it over in time. Could have been too many touches, but it'll come back for Gasser and dug out. Far side, light touch this time, and the Blue Jays grab the point. It might have to be a little bit less, three or less, against a team like Creighton. Here's Madeline Cole, dug out by Gasser. And it'll come for her again, and kept alive. Spellbar's got to just put it over. Witt set down the middle. Hickman blocked, but out of play as she credit her with the kill. You know, uh, I don't know. I'm going to th I'm gonna have to think on it. And miss dug by Gasser there as that'll be Madeline Cole grabs the ace. It's the Blue Jays' third here in the first set. Here's Cole looking to close it out for the Blue Jays. Set for Salkowski, and that'll do it. Pirates gave the Blue Jays some trouble in the first set, but they're able to rebound and take it 25 to 19. Yeah, Five nothing run to open up set two. Seton Hall will look to stop that. Here's Felbar for Turner, and blocked back down. Credit that to Naomi Hickman. And Seton Hall's going to have to burn an early timeout here in set two. Here in set two. And as that one comes down the middle for Zimmerman, and she puts a charge into that one to grab the kill. The change has always been a great player, but you've just noticed something in her demeanor that's just making her a lot more aggressive. Well, talk about aggressive. That's Erica Kostelak on that kill. Themselves second and third opportunities. Felbar tried to just hit it over, but she couldn't do it, and now it's 17 to 10. Witt plays that one, set far side. Dolezal, a little bit of confusion here as the Pirates get it back over. Down the middle, and Wilkins can't get there on the dive. When she gets going. Here's Dolzol, far side for Gasser. Witt keeps it alive, what a dig. Here's Davis off the top of the net. For Gasser one more time. Brittany Witt having herself a day and it'll advantage for her teammates as now it's 23 to 15. Well, there's a reason she's second in crit in history all time in digs. Less than 300 away from that Blue Jay record, Brittany. 24-16, Spellbar looks to keep it alive for the Pirates. Far side, blocked down. Blue Jays to set it up again. Here's Murray. Spellbar for Salkowski, out of play. So the Blue Jays win set two, 25-16. Here's Brittany Witt. And Satung lets it go, but then knew the minute she did that it was going to be an ace. On the team and kills. Here's the set near side, dug out by Murray. Nice play. And the Pirates just have to get it over. Here's the set near side one more time for Hickman, but kept alive. Murray puts it over. The so Jays can set it up. Far side this time gets the kill. Kostelak. And that is definitely a good thing to keep an eye on because there were a lot more in last night's match, so that's something they probably worked on. As the Blue Jays grab the ace on the miss hit by Wilkins. Now 22 to 11. 
It'll be Rockwall to try and keep it alive. Far side, light tap. And that'll do it. As it'll be an error that ends this game for the Pirates as the Creighton Blue Jays come away with the three set to zero victory. Yeah, and we kind of just saw it progressively.